So uh, now we got this clue that um, there's different energy associated with different forms of electromagnetic radiation and that the energy is in some forms of electromagnetic radiation strong enough to be what we call ionizing radiation, which it can disrupt um, the, uh, the break bonds. Now, different types of electromagnetic radiation are going to interact with matter differently depending on their energy. And um, we will look later at how infrared radiation interacts with matter. Um, we will look, and then um, the radio waves and microwaves, unless the microwave is tuned to a particular frequency within that broad, broad spectrum and is of high enough intensity, you're not gonna, there's no damaging effect of microwaves to people. Um, it's just if you crawl inside a microwave oven. And so anyway, we'll look at all that kind of stuff later on. For now, we're going to focus on UV radiation because that's the storyline we're sticking with because we want to understand this concept of a stratospheric ozone.